fish on. What is it? Look at that, finally caught something. It's a baby dolly. Such a cool looking fish. Let me stay back. What is going on guys? Today I'll be fishing the Skagit River. I'll be casting out a fish jump. There's sockeye kings in the river, dollies coming in, and a bunch of trout. So let's see if we can get some action. my Akuma Guide Select Pro. This is a 9 foot 80 17 pound rod with a diver reel. Right, so I got a three way swivel to a one ounce weight about a three and a half four foot liter to a deck knight spoon got that silver and star truce. The setup I'm going to be using it's a Lamy Glass X11 9 foot 6 with a Shimano Crotter reel. Got a sliding swivel to a 4 ounce pyramid weight, about a 4 foot liter, down to a spinning glow and cool shrimp. Hit. Hitting it again. Come on. There you go. Get a hit. Come on, take it, just take it. Something just nibbling on it. Check my bait. to cast the same spot right there it's early again still new two plankins so I am yet to catch a fish on this setup. Let's see if today's the day. Okay, hit hard. Oh man. And I get snagged. Alright guys, this time I did my setup a little different. I have a divider, a little liter to a 3 ounce weight, about a 2 foot liter, and two pink and white spinning gloves and a cone shrimp. 
see if this works any better. So I feel it in my hand. Something. Still my bait. Got a fish on, guys. I didn't even know. Look at that. That's a big trout. It's a cutthroat. Look at that thing, guys. on the schedule you can keep them over 14 inches fifteen and a half it's a keeper bleed them out not the sockeye I was hoping for but as you guys could see you could keep three sockeye you can keep 20 inch dollies and cut through trout 14 inches minimum size so i'm good to go i already knew that that's why i wouldn't bunk a fish unless i was sure that I was getting that I kept missing I mean I think I know what it was <laughs> it was the same trout that's all my bait right there inside the stomach just full of my shrimp cone shrimp <laughs> there you go that's all I ate <laughs> not as red but gonna be a lot tastier than a stalker trout that's for sure all right guys so i'm gonna cook the trout that i cut yesterday i'm gonna keep it simple just do some sea salt garlic powder black pepper throw on the grill and see how it compares to the stalker trout Also like to add just a little bit of olive oil so it doesn't stick to the grill as much with that seasoning rubbed in there really good
got the fish on the grill should take about six minutes i would say like three minutes on each side you do not want to overcook fish ready it looks a little white but that's pretty common for a trout to turn that color after cooking it mm. that is good right away I can tell you it's much better a lot more flavor than a stalker trout it's really good, mild fish. You want some chew, buddy? Let me get him a piece in here. Do you approve? He approves. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for this video. Gonna finish the trout, finish editing this video, and. See you guys in the next one.